Hello, happy breast family fun. How's it going? The title of my video for today is say, Power in the Word of God. The power of God's word in nature. Through what agent did God create heavens? We read that in Psalm 33, verse 6 to 9. It says, But the word of the Lord, the heaven were made, and all the host of them, by the breath of his mouth, he gathered the water of the sea together as heap. He raised up the heap in the storehouse. Let all the earth fear the Lord. Let all the inhabitants of the world stand in a way of him. For he spoke and it was done. He commanded and stood fast. And we read it again in Psalm 148 verse 5. One forty eight verse five. It says, Let them praise the name of the Lord, for he commanded the and they were created. He also established them forever and ever. He made decree which shall not pass away. So, in everything God said, it happened. There is a power in the word of God. God was a word at the beginning. Everything he did, he used word. But one thing he didn't use a word when he created a human. He used his hands. So you see how different we are from animals or any creature. Everything he used words, but as human, he used his hands, sorry. So it means we are so special. You and I, we are so special. So if somebody called you, you are nothing. They don't understand how special you are. To touch by God, the creator of the universe, and the breath you have in your lungs is from heaven. It's from God. Because Jesus breathed in Adam's mouth. You see how special you are. There is a power in the word of God. Even demon, they are afraid of word of god if you pray and use the word of god nothing can stand you the more you spend the time in the word of god more devil will be afraid of you the, me and my friends we used to say when you read the bible so much when you spend the time with god when you wake up when you wake up Devil start to say, oh crap, she or he is awake because they are afraid of you. Because you spend the time in the word of God. And when you pray, use God's word and they are afraid of that. So I will encourage you today, use the word of God in everything you do. Remember when Satan was tested, he tested God. What did God answer him? I mean Jesus. When he asked him to turn stone into a bread, what did he say? He used a word, a word of God. He said, the word said, you too, when you pray, use a word of God. There's a power in the word of God. Nothing can stand the word of, a word of God. You have <clears throat> a power on your tongue. When you have a Bible, when you memorize it, 
Because when you meet with the devil, you don't say, oh, I have to go and look in the Bible. No. Find the time to read the Bible. Not to read like you're reading a newspaper. Read it and memorize it. When the devil comes to you, you answer him with the word of God. You don't have the time to run and the open Bible. You need to put your Bible in your brain. Ask God to give you a brain like a machine to memorize his word. But the more you read the Bible and you repeat and you repeat, it's going to come in your brain. Use a word of God. Enjoy your day, my friends. I love you all. Be blessed.